let's move on to the individual nerves how to block all of these nerves how to block the root trunks as well as uh, the infraclavicular uh, approaches to the brachial plexus block have been discussed in section of regional anesthesia so the first nerve that we have here is the axillary nerve it is also called as the circumflex nerve okay circumflex means going in a circle so it arises from c5 c6 that is from the upper trunk and it's a part also of the posterior cord okay now the course of the axillary nerve is basically it will go behind it won't come in the front it will go behind and it will pass through the space which is called as a quadrangular space and this is an easy space behind where we can find the axillary nerve and block it okay now where do we want to block the axillary nerve any shoulder surgeries any surgeries of the lateral part of the clavicle any surgeries in this area okay so basically proximal humerus i want to block the axillary nerve so this quadrangular space is bound by the teres major the teres minor and the long head of the biceps brachii and the surgical neck of the humerus and this is where i easily find my axillary nerve along with the axillary vessels so this is what you need to remember